Hello everyone and welcome to the Slam Society here for our beloved series here, Slam Reacts. I'm one of your hosts, California. This is Juicy Boy. How you doing, bro? Dude, not too bad. How you doing? I'm doing good, bro. I'm doing real good. How you, how you doing? How you it's, doing? You know? how, how, how you fucking doing, huh? How you going? How I'm you doing? doing? I'm doing great, bro. It's, it's great to be a part of the Slam Society and it's great to be here for Slam Reacts, formerly known yeah, as WCWA like uh... Reacts. I feel like it's been ages since we've sat down and recorded one of these. So it's uh, been a while since we have recorded. Someone lick my balls. Um. So anyway. So, uh, all right, let's do it. <laughs> right. So here we go today. This is an interesting one. Mm. Um, and I want to thank uh my good friend. I'd say my good friend. I've I've only talked to him a little bit here and there, but he's very no well known in the deathmatch wrestling circles. Uh, Blake O five six one. I want to thank him for uh, sending this video to me. He had to get it off a hard drive for me because uh, you can't really find it anywhere online except for a highlight package. But this is like an infamous thing that happened in Big Japan Pro Wrestling Juice Boy twenty first yeah, of is August. It? Why is it infamous? Well, I'll tell you in a second. Uh, 21st of August, 2003. Uh, so there's a guy called the uh, Great Kajika. He mm. put on this show at Kuroken Hall in Tokyo mm -hmm. uh, for Big Japan Pro Wrestling for Great Ch Kajika's sorry, house death match. So all matches take place in Great Kajika's replicated house. Uh, okay, and so they... They built a house basically so that they could do this in there. Absolutely. And the match that we are going to get to cover here, because every match was uh, in this house. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, it's a bunkhouse kitchen death match. Madman Pondo, who's been on the Insider's Edge podcast on this channel, uh, taking on a guy who we've had on uh, Slam Reacts before, Abdullah Kobayashi. So I'm really excited to check this out with you, bro. This is uh, this is one of those weird things. We've we've done a few of these things where you know, uh, Japanese uh, uh, wrestling. Like remember when we watched the one where they were fighting through the supermarket and everything? Yeah, that's um, a favorite of mine. <laughs> I might um, watch that after this, but yeah. Um, are you excited, bro? I'm excited, a little scared, um, but you know, let's get into it. All right, let's do it. Okay. As we, all, as we all know, to the side, everyone. Okay, here we go. Yeah. Slam reacts. Greg Kajika's house death match in three, two, one, play. Kurodai Chen. <laughs> the saucepans and shit in the background. <laughs> 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 what is happening? Feel <laughs> 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 like a home invasion. <laughs> I gotta get Pondo back in the podcast to talk about this. <laughs> Well, this has gotten real fast, real oh. wild, real fast. Through a wall. <laughs> He's still holding the fork. There he is, the legend himself. How fun would this be, bro? Yeah. <laughs> yeah no. A big fish. <laughs> <laughs> Doing a little crab walk there. Ah, oh, oh, whipped him with it. <laughs> a, a bold Japanese man just got whipped with a crab. <laughs> oh. Just belted with a fish. <laughs> Stupid. <laughs> Camera pads out there actually in a in a in a gym. This is just fun, bro. Oh, 
Uh, if I was a wrestler and I was told that I was going to get to do a match like this, I'd be so excited. <laughs> All right, here we go. It looks like a suit play on the out, out, out here, out on the, the back on the, area. On the fake grass. Yeah. Look at all the effort. They've even got plants. Oh! Nice suple. Pondo's up before the guy that delivered it. Oh! <laughs> I just realized Kobayashi's wearing a... He was wearing a... Kitchen apron. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> He's got that big fork. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> it's not going to break. <laughs> How annoying. Oh, dude. Oh, dear. Oh, what's he going to do? Don't shame it, man, yourself, bro. <laughs> <laughs> that heavy chair full force wasn't enough. <laughs> <laughs> Fear the commentators laugh too. <laughs> Back to the fork again. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> the commentator keeps laughing. <laughs> he still hasn't managed to use the fork offensively. <laughs> He's got something out of the fridge. <laughs> He's got some, there's some eggs. <laughs> oh man, he's gonna dump it. No. No, that would that would smell gross. <laughs> it still beats the hell out of doing those glass death matches that he does, bro. <laughs> How can you even do a move? An Irish whip. Come on. <laughs> it's too grand. <laughs> <laughs> Why? <laughs> watermelon Why to the head. The head of cabbage. <laughs> it was a watermelon, wasn't it? Uh, yeah, it was. Yeah. <laughs> oh, oh what a gained. <laughs> How do you even figure out what you, your finish is going to be for this? Oh, I've got tears in my eyes. <laughs> Pondo's going to ascend to the top of the sink here. No. <laughs> what are you... <laughs> the sink's going to be slippery as fuck. There's no way. <laughs> that could have been more shit. <laughs> he won with it. <laughs> He knew he couldn't jump because it was slippery. Uh. <laughs> Commentators are still laughing. That was fantastic, bro. That was oh my um... god. I'm gonna have to get Blake to send me the whole show, man. That's seriously. Yeah, yeah. I want to yeah. see what else happened. <laughs> yeah, I feel like I, I, I feel compelled to see that as well. Oh, bro, excellent stuff. Well, again, thank you to Blake uh, 0561 for that video. Um, and if you want to use any clips from the Insider's Edge podcast on your channel, you're more than welcome to, my friend. We will uh, plug your channel in the description. Uh, so, Juicy mm. Boy, mm. that was fun, bro. Any any extra thoughts on it? Um, 
like it's it's hard to believe that it's not the weirdest thing probably that we've seen so far on this on this series <laughs> um yeah that that was really quite the fact that they had an entire card and every match took place in this setting that they put up there's not even a ring there <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You know, it's, it's like in theater, Hall. <laughs> it's like theater auditorium style scene. Dude, the I other matches. Go. Okay, there's a there's a bathroom chain death match. <laughs> there's a domestic violence tag team match. <laughs> what the fuck? Uh, and a house annihilation eight man tag team death match. <laughs> So there's only four matches, so everyone who's in the first three matches, they all wrestle in the uh, eight-man to destroy the house, I suppose, but damn, we need to get our hands on it. Yes, we do. Um, yeah, let us know in the comments uh, if you think that, you know, if you want to see us cover this entire issue, we're, we're going to do it either way, um, you know, so fuck you, but we would. <laughs> we are interested in what you want to know, and we want to hear from you in the comments. It takes two seconds, it's free. Hit that like, hit that subscribe. Um, hit we are on our way to 2K, um, which in the grand schemes is still pretty minimal, but you know, we're excited to have those of you who are with us. We're excited that you're here. We're looking forward to growing that number. Like, subscribe, hope you enjoyed it, bitch. Yep, and hit the bell, please, so you get told every time we upload a video, which is usually once a day or once every couple of days. So yeah. thank you again, Juicy Boy, for your time. Yeah, no, yeah, no worries. Yeah. Yeah, and thank all of you out there for joining us here for Slam Reacts. Here on the yeah. Slam Society, California. Yeah. Juicy Boy, guess what? Yeah. We will see you down the road. Thank you. <laughs>